Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Cars and Cloud. So in this video, I'm going to deploy feature updates to my Windows 10 device from Intune. So as you can see here, I have Windows 10 1903 and I'm going to deploy Windows 10 1909 feature updates to this device. So now let's get started. We're gonna to go to Microsoft Intune. So I have Intune portal here. Let me go to Azure Active Directory. Actually, let me go back to dashboard and then go to portal.azure.com. And I have a shortcut for Intune here. If you don't have it, create. You can search for it and you should find it. So I'm going to click on Intune. So to, def to deploy feature updates in the Intune portal here, you need to go to Software Updates. And then go to Windows 10 Feature Updates. I created this earlier. Let me delete this one out. I'm going to create a profiles. It's going to call Windows Feature Update to 1909. The description, leave it blank. Feature Update Deployment Settings. I'm going to choose 1909. As you can see, there's a bunch of them you can um, select. 1909, click next. The assigned to, you want to choose the group of computers that you want to deploy to. So you're going to select, select groups to include. The group I want to deploy to is Windows 10. So you have to choose a security groups. It cannot be a specific computer. If you have, if you want to upgrade to one computer, then you need to create a, a, a security group for that computer. Like in this case, my computer group is called Windows 10 11, Audacity 011. And the computer name is also Windows 10 dash 011. Select it and click select. As you can see, the group it shows up here. And then you want to click next. Here is the summary page. You want to make sure everything is correct here. The deployment settings, the name of the, the deployment. The descriptions, nothing. I don't have anything for subscription. Feature deployment settings. This is going to deploy Windows 10, 1909. Assignment groups. It's deployed to Windows 10 11. Click on create. Once you confirm everything, it's okay. You need to create and you should see the uh, notification see on the top right that the, uh, the deployment has been created. And if you look over here, it is has been created. You can click on it. In a few minutes, you're going to see a status of the deployment. You can click on a monitor and go to and, and use the status. This will um, provide the the deployment it failed here because this is an it's an old um, it's an old uh, mess status message since I'm using the same computer name or the group name so that's it that's how you deploy Windows 10 uh, Windows switch update in Intune thank you for watching if you have any question feel free to put in the comment sections 
and have a great day.